One, two, one, two, one, two. Okay, we're about to start. One, two, one, two, one, two. One, two, one, two. Can you hear me? Yes. Excellent. Gabriel, welcome. Thank you, teacher. How are you? I'm great. Great. I'm just waiting for your class. Sorry, I can't hear. You can't. I'm connecting Wi Fi. Okay. Okay. I'm just waiting for everybody. Hello, everyone. Hello, hello. Okay, let, let's go one by one. Let me make sure that you can hear me. Okay, you can hear me? Yes. Yes, I can hear you. Hear you well. Yes. Very good. Yes. Okay, guys, I need you to turn on your camera. Step number one, turn on your camera. Number two, make sure that your name is displayed. Make sure that you have your full name, you know, at least first name and last name, okay? First name and last name on your screen. It's done. Yeah, Alvin Silva, I have the real Alvarado, Aleida Vasquez, Menia, Abigail Trejo, Jonathan Castillo, Francisco Martinez, Carla Molina. Hello. Melissa Flores, Jacqueline Guardado. Jacqueline, can you please turn on your camera? Ricardo Alexander, please turn on your camera. And I need your last name, Ricardo Alexander. <clears throat> Ernesto Molina, turn on your camera. Josue Aguilar. We are 14 already. Hello, Jacqueline. Nice to meet you. Okay, we are 14. 
I think we can simply start the class. Welcome to our first session. Okay, today is our first session and nobody else is coming. So let's wait, let's start this. So if you watched the video with my introduction, you know my name, what's my name? <laughs> Rafael. Okay, it says Rafael. Rafael Linares. Everybody at, here at Regal International at English Corporativo knows me as Rafael Linares. My full name is Rafael Antonio Rodriguez Linares. I'm 38, I'm married, I have three kids, and I have taught English for six years uh, on this course at, um, you know, with Inglés Nacional para el Trabajo, Programa Nacional de Inglés para el Trabajo, or PNIT. PNIT. Okay, so let me hear from you guys really quick. Um, with first, I'm going to share with you my screen because I want to keep taking notes and everything here. One second. Okay, so here we are. Let me hear a little bit about you. And we have 20 minutes. We only have 20 minutes for this part of the session, which is welcoming, welcoming all of you. So let's start introducing yourself. So when you hear, when you hear this sound, let me see which one. Okay, did you hear that? Yep. Okay, so that, yeah, means, yes. that means the time is over and we have to move on to the next the next stage of the class okay so for now i'm just gonna leave this here don't pay attention to this okay so let's go i'm gonna stop sharing the screen there we go so let's start in the order of the um of my screen i have alvin silva first on the left so Alvin, if you want to introduce yourself, if this tell us if this is the first time you are on Inglés Corporativo, you know, you're in intermediate three. So let's start, Alvin, and then you choose somebody else. One, two, three, action. Hey, hello everyone. My name is Alvin Silva. I'm a teacher of social science in, in um, ABC, and I'm trying to um, to learn English because my my world needs that for me. So. Uh, it's, uh, it's, I'm glad to be with you, and I'm trying to, to learn for, uh, to, for everyone. Thank you. Ah, I, I have uh, 37 years old, and I'm married too. I have a, a baby of six months, and well, in this moment I am in my car <laughs> because there are too many uh, noise in, in, my, in my house. Thank you. Okay. Okay. Can you still hear me? All good? Yeah. Okay. Did you did you listen to Alvin? Can you do this? Show me your finger. Did you yes. Okay. Great. Okay. Let's move on. Who is next, Alvin? Who is next? Uh, the next is Jonathan Casillo. Jonathan Cerrillos, Castillo, Jonathan. Castillo. Okay, Jonathan, ready? One, two, three, action. Hello. Hey, Jonathan. <laughs> Hello. Okay, Jonathan, if you want, you can um, Sorry, I have a problem with my computer. <laughs> no. Okay, uh, can you hear me? That's the audio is...
Yona, can you continue? Yes, uh, hello. You can, you can listen to me? Yes, we can hear you now. Okay. Uh, sorry, but I don't listen to indication in the class. Uh, but I think that, okay. Hello, my name is Jonathan. Um, I have 28 years old. Um, I need to learn more English and practice. And I think that this class is important for me. Awesome, very good. Great job, Jonathan. Thanks. Okay, select somebody else. And let me see, Francisco. Uh, Martinez. Martinez, sorry. Okay, Francisco. Francisco Martinez, uh, I go. only check the microphone, and I'm a lawyer. I'm I I married. I have uh, one child, the one year and four months. It's a pleasure to me stay here in this in this chat, in this video, in these lessons, beginning together. Excellent. Thank you. Let's go. Choose okay. a, select somebody else. Okay. Gabriel Alvarado. Gabriela Alvarado. Hey, okay. thank you. Okay. You're welcome. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Thank you, my friends. Uh, I am Gabriel Alvarado. I am uh, 37 years old. I am married. Uh, I am manager to Huevos Catalana. It's a pleasure uh, be with you. Uh, and I, my object, my target is learn English, learn full English. Okay, perfect. I yes, I have to for for some. For, for some, actually. Thank you. Okay, great. Great job, Gabriel. Select somebody else. Choose somebody else. Okay. Let me see. Saida Hernandez. Okay. Hernandez? Yeah. Saida. Saida, her Good night. Yeah, Saida Hernandez. Good night, everybody. Uh, my name is Saida Carolina Hernandez Flores. I'm 28 years old. I'm single and I live in Lopango with my parents. Excellent. Very good, Saida. Select somebody else. Um, Aleida Raquel Vázquez. Aleida Raquel Vázquez. Thank you. Hello, everybody. Uh, my name is Aleida Vázquez. I'm 30 years old. I'm living in Mexicanos. I'm working in a call center in, in sales department. Uh, but this is Spanish. Call center. And, sorry, I, I'm living alone with my, with my dog and somebody is near to my home and so he's it's okay. He's, he's making noise. <laughs> Sorry. And I'm I'm so happy to be here with you and I hope to I hope learn um a little more of English. Excellent, very good. Okay, select somebody else later. Okay, um Carla Molina. Carla Molina, okay. Hi, good, good evening. I'm Carla Molina. I'm 32 years old. I'm a student of industrial engineering. Also, I'm working to, uh, to a bank. 
and I feel very good uh, meeting you, you all, in order to learn and uh, and learn to be. I choose. Um, I'm sorry. Maria Gomez. Maria Gomez, okay. Hello, Maria Gomez. Hello. Good evening, guys. Uh, my name is Maria Gomez. I am a system engineer. I, I work in uh, technical support. I am 32 years old and I live in Santa Tecla. Okay, perfect, Maria. Thank you. Can you select somebody else? Um, let me see. Um, Aleida, ya pasó. <laughs> yes. Yeah, uh, Saida. Saida. Saida Hernández. Yes. <laughs> ¿Quién no ha pasado? <laughs> Who else? <laughs> Who is... <laughs> Hello. Um, hello. Hello. My name is Melissa. Uh, I am 28 years old. Um, I work in financing. I like to um, learn English because I like to to travel and for grow up in my job or in another job. Excellent, very good. Thank you, Melissa Flores. Can you select somebody else? I don't know <laughs> who what who happened. Who who else? Who are I women? Who are I think I think that all people pass. No, we're missing Jacqueline. Jacqueline Guardado. Okay, Jose. Okay. Let me see. Ismenia Abigail. Hi everyone, I'm Ismenia, uh, I am 23 years old, and I'm a Bachelor of International Affairs, so uh, I want to improve my English, just oh, that. Awesome, that was amazing, great job, okay, select somebody else. Hello, hello. Melissa Flores. Okay, Melissa Flores. I'm finished my presentation. You finished my your presentation. Okay, I'm done. Then you say I'm done with my presentation. Okay. Okay. Somebody else. Okay, I am Jacqueline Guardado. Uh, I am 32 years old. Uh, I am a marketing professional. Uh, I live in Santa Tecla and I live with my family. And I hope to, to learn and practice a lot of English. That's it. And very good. Thank you. Okay, great job. Who else is missing? Um, okay, guys, before we move on, I need you to make sure you have your first name and a last name at least. Okay, and there is someone named Xiomara, and I need you to turn on your camera. Ernesto Molina, Ismaela, Ismaela Abigail, Ricardo Alexander, Alexander, I think, uh, Xiomara. Yes, I'm here, but. I really apologize because my camera doesn't work right now. Oh, okay. Yes. Okay. Only, only today, but only today. Just today. Okay. Just for today. today. Okay. Just today. We lost some, somebody left. Okay. And there's a Chromebook. There's a Chromebook connected, but we don't, we cannot see the face and there's no name. So 
it is very important. Um, I'm just letting you know, um, we must have our faces, you know, and the full name there is very important for the auditing of this course. So, hi, hi. Let me see. Hi, teacher. I'm sorry, I have a problem with my computer and I'm logging in other account. In another account, okay? Perfect. Okay. Thank you. Um, your name. My first Oh, okay. Um, I am Elena. Give me one second. <laughs> Elena. I am Maria Elena. Oh, Maria. Uh, mm -hmm. Maria Elena, yeah. Uh, <clears throat> mm -hmm. And your last I name? Live, I'm sorry. Maria Elena Tamayo. I live in, in, in Zacatecoluca City. Um, I live with my children. And I want to learn more English, but my word. Um, that. That's it. Simple. Very good. Thank you, Marilena. Okay, Xiomara, Xiomara, what's your last name, if you may? I'm sorry, Hernandez. I'm Xiomara Hernandez. Right. Can I introduce myself? <laughs> Please. Go ahead. Thank you very much. My name is Xiomara Hernandez. I'm a teacher. I'm 33 years old, I'm a mom, I'm married, and I want to perform my English very well. Excellent, what do you teach? I'm sorry? What do you teach? Science, math, and... History. Science and math. <laughs> and uh -huh. history. it's like sociales, right? History, I guess. Okay. <laughs> No, only science and math. Just, just science and math. Okay, guys, welcome, welcome to this course. Uh, so let's talk about the rules on this new modality. You know, like new uh, thing that we're doing uh, is very different because we are not in a specific place. Technology is amazing, and each one of you is at home, I guess. Um, so you may feel a little bit different. Okay. What is important in this classroom that you have? Uh, well, this ugly face that you see here, you got to follow, follow my lips when I'm speaking, okay? Number one, you have to be on time at 8.59 p.m., okay? Number two, you cannot miss any class. Remember, this is a scholarship. It's a scholarship, so... There's a lot of people who wants to be here, you know, but they don't, they don't have the opportunity. You have a big opportunity. Please take advantage of it. It's free. Uh, number three, I think I'm on number three, right? Okay. Always put your full name there. I will make sure I check the attendance at 9 p.m. And also I will check the attendance at 9.45 p.m every single day okay and you have to respond if i say alvin silva you're gonna say presente teacher <laughs> you have to say here okay you say here repeat here okay here excellent very good I saw, right here excellent ricardo alexander I, I think i saw a picture of him somewhere there we go okay so uh what else what else is important oh we have a discussion forum where you have to participate. So after the video is recorded or maybe during the class, uh, can you raise your hand? Who has a computer? Who is on a computer or will be on a computer the whole module? Let me see your hand. Will be on a computer? On a computer? Okay, Melissa is not on a computer. She's on a cell phone. Are you on a cell phone, Jacqueline? Yes, right now, yes. Okay, uh, so please try, try to be on a computer if possible. If not, it's okay, don't yes. worry. Yes, but I need the, the ID, the ID for connecting the computer. Oh, to connect in the computer? It's, not, it's the same one, it's the same ID that I, I will always send you the link on the WhatsApp group. Oh. Ex okay. Except for the personal sessions, the one-on-one, -on -one, the one-on-one -on -one meetings, 
that we will have on Wednesdays at 10 p.m. On Wednesdays at 10 p.m., you will have a session, a private session for about 10 minutes with me. Are you aware of that? Do you know that? Yes? Yes. 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 So, any questions that you have about this new thing that we're going to do? No? Okay, guys. I use Pareto's Law. I use Pareto's Law. 80, okay, 80, 20. Which means that you speak 80% and I speak 20%. Okay? Okay. okay. My job is to correct your speaking at this point. Number one. Number two. So if you don't make mistakes, you know, I don't have a job. Okay. So you have, please, please make mistakes. Make mistakes. Number two. Um, I have to teach you at this level because you're in intermediate three now. So I have to teach you about some professional topics. I am a technical engineer. I know about engineering, uh, re-engineering. Oh, time is up, 20 minutes. Okay, so really quick, I also studied international relations at Universidad Francisco Gavidia, and I love teaching, okay? That's it about me. Uh, please, for the next time, Ricardo, Xiomara, and Ernesto, try to turn on your, your camera at all times. Insaform needs to see your face, okay? We have to show our, fa our beautiful faces, <laughs> okay? So, let's go, <laughs> okay. So, let me see, let's go with the classroom. Really quick, just to finish this section of 20 minutes, let me, let me correct, because it's very important for you to always um, be corrected, you know, to get feedback. Feedback is very important for you. You know feedback? Okay, let's go with the yeah. Okay. Someone said, I'm married. I'm married. Okay, you have to say, I'm married. I'm married. I'm married. I'm married. Yeah, the R, the R in English, is produced with a U shape. So you say, okay, for example, car. And then your tongue comes to the back. Car, okay. Me, me red. red. Me, me red. Okay, so me I'm red. Me red. Okay. And someone was saying, good night. Good night to everyone. <laughs> I'm sorry, my ring. <clears throat> there you go. So, good night. Now, you say good evening. Evening. Good evening. Good evening. Okay. Okay. Good evening. Good evening. Good. Good evening. So, you say good night at the end of the class. You say good night when you go to bed. You say good night. And that's it. Okay? <laughs> so, good night is the same as saying bye-bye. Okay, good night. Mm -hmm. Next, I single pronunciation. Listen, I'm I single. I'm single. Okay, I'm single. Again, I'm I'm working at um I'm working to a bank. No prepositions at a bank. Listen, I'm working at a bank. I'm working at a bank. Or I'm working. I mean, I'm sorry. I work. At a bank. I work at a bank. At a bank. Okay, good. And okay, who's missing? That was the question, the right question. Who's missing? I will always do this. Correct your pronunciation. At this point in intermediate on intermediate three, we have to work on pronunciation. Okay. So let's do it together, okay? Okay. Jamás nos enojamos de la corrección. Jamás nos reímos de un compañero. That's the rule. Y la más importante, always talk. Always talk in the classroom, okay? Don't be shy. Okay. Perfect. Okay, let's continue. So, let me 
share with you something else so we can move on. I'm gonna set this, the, um, the clock again for 20 minutes because we're gonna move to something else right now. The first page of this class will be about present perfect. Who remembers the present perfect? Present perfect, come on, somebody. Hello, hello, present perfect. Verbs. Verbs? Verbs. It's by A, A, A and G. I and G. Hmm. Uh, when uh, when the verb is in a uh, particip participle. Uh... Perfect. Abigail, Abigail, thank you. When the verb is in past participle. Everybody? Participle. 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 Okay. Participle. Participle. I never let things go by. Nunca dejo que las cosas pasen por alto. So let's correct that. Voy a dar una clave para hablar super rápido y bien. Sorry if I speak Spanish, but I think this is necessary. Y ahora en adelante quiero que te fijes cada vez que escuches una palabra en, en inglés nueva en donde eh, okay, en inglés no hay acento, hay estrés de la sílaba. So, ¿dónde está el estrés aquí? Es participle. Okay. Participle. 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 Okay, participle. 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 Okay, participle. So, participle. Y la T se vuelve muda, se convierte como una R. You say participle. So, here, have the stress. Here you have the stress of the syllable. Entonces, de ahora en adelante quiero que tomes nota de cada palabra nueva que aprendas y le pongas una pequeña seña y encima a esa sílaba que está estresada, ¿ok? No hay tilde, hay estrés en la sílaba. Eso es de básico uno, señores. Let's learn it, ¿ok? So, participle, ¿ok? Got it. Let's go with the next topic. Ok, let's go with the next topic. And we're going to talk now about the person perfect. Let me share a presentation that I have for you here. And so we can move on. Hmm. Going too fast, okay. Okay, I'm waiting for this thing. Please let me share something else with you. Oh, let me try. Okay, so I have a presentation for you. Can you see this? Yes. yes. Okay, can you see this now? Can you see this? Listen to the common sentences. Yes. Yes? Okay. Yes. Great. Yes. Okay. Got it. Let's go. Let's remember some important things in the classroom. How to say some things. These are common sentences. Okay, the first one is, teacher, how do you say in English? How did you say? How do you say? How did you say? How do you say? How do you say? Okay, give me one second. How did you say? How do you say? Okay. This thing is getting stuck, I'm sorry. Okay. I put you on mute. There's a lot of noise in the background. So, common sentences. Listen and repeat. How do you say? Okay, how do you say? How do you say? How do you, how you say? See ya in English. Say or, see ya in English. Yeah. The object, right? How do you say see ya in English? You say chair. Yes, chair. How, how, chair. Do you use it? how do you use it? Okay. I have a chair. Okay. I sit on a chair. 
How do you say nadar in English? Say swim. How do you use it? Okay, I have swim. I have swum. Okay, I have swum in a lake. I have swum in a lake. Okay. How do you spell that? Swim. S W I M. How do you spell that? I. Okay. Excuse me. Listen. Excuse me. I didn't get that. Teacher. I very important. I didn't. So you stop me, you stop and you say, uh, Jonathan, repeat. Excuse me, I didn't get that. I didn't, I get, didn't that. get that. Didn't get that, sorry. I didn't get that. Okay, can you repeat it? Can you repeat it? Can you repeat it? Can you repeat it? Perfect. You repeat it? Okay, next. What's the meaning of get? For example, what's the meaning of? of get. Okay. What's the meaning? What's the meaning of? of get? When you don't understand a verb or a new word, okay? Next, and the last one. May I go to the bathroom? May I go to the bathroom? Yes. You have to ask for permission to go to the bathroom in this class. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. So it's a teacher. May I go to the bathroom? Okay. May oh. I go to the bathroom? Yes. Hey, go, go to the bathroom. Go to, go to. Go to bathroom. Go to the, go to the. Go to the. Bathroom. Bathroom. Okay. Good. And last one. May I take this call? Hey, teacher. May I take this call? Okay. May I take this call? Excellent. Okay, let's move on with the presentation about present perfect. Let me see how much time we have in our classroom. We have 13 minutes, so let's do it together. Okay, guys, pay attention. Guys, if there is too much noise in your background, please uh, mute your microphone. Okay, good. So we have the present perfect. What is the present perfect? Okay, let me see. Melissa, please, can you read? Uh, just to describe an action that has recently a uh, finisher or previous experience that may affect the present. Perfect, very good, Melissa. Now, let's repeat. Used to describe Describe. Just to describe. An action. An action. Repeat. An action. An action. Okay. Action. Action. Better. That has recently. That has recently. Repeat. Recently. Recently. Better. Finished. Finish. Finished. Finish. 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 There you go. Finished. Finish. Okay, there's a T sound at the end. Hay un sonido t al final de esa ED, porque es un verbo regular. Tarea, Melissa, revisar los verbos regulares que terminan en ED. Pronunciación de los verbos regulares que terminan en ED. Okay? Finish. Okay. And on your book is actually the previous experiences that may affect the present. Okay, so we're going to talk about experiences today on our topic. So examples, listen, we have some examples. The first one, I've already told you. I've already told you. I've already told you. I've already told you. Which means, ya te lo dije, right? Okay, I've already told you. Next, you've worked here for a long time. You've worked here for a long time. Okay. Next, they've just stopped the new product line. They've just stopped the new product line. Okay, they've just stopped, stopped the new product line. Okay, she hasn't tried it yet. She hasn't tried it, 
tried it yet. Next. We still haven't sold a single unit. We still haven't sold a single unit. Next one. Have you seen the competitor's new product? Have you seen the competitor's new product? And last, have they just come out of the meeting? Haven't they just come out of the meeting? Sorry. Haven't they just come out of the meeting? Now, all of these are examples of the present perfect. Now, I like to do something because we don't live in America, we don't live in Europe. We were not raised um, listening to English. So let's put this in our context, okay, in Spanish. Can somebody give me a sentence in present perfect in Spanish? Somebody? Volunteer or victim? Yo he estudiado inglés. Perfect. Yo he estudiado inglés. Okay, what's the negative? Go with the negative. Yo no he estudiado inglés. Question. He estudiado inglés. Perfect. Open question. Uh -huh. Open question. Who's talking? Bertha. <laughs> so you said, yes, we are English. What is an open question? Por qué estudiado inglés? Excellent. Very good. Por qué estudiado inglés? So you add WH, why have I studied mm -hmm. English? Very good, Bertha. Great job. Okay. That's the present perfect. Makes sense? Makes sense? So what is the structure? Now, let's walk the talk. Repeat, let's walk the talk. Walk the talk. Walk the talk. Walk, walk the, talk. the talk. Okay, it's not walk, it's walk, walk, walk. Walk, walk, walk the talk. Walk the talk. Very uh, good, okay, walk, walk, the, talk. walk the talk. Let's talk walk about, the talk. yeah, let's talk about positive statements, okay? So on positive statements, you have a subject, the auxiliary have or has, then the past participle of the verb, the third form, okay? And then you have a complement, okay? That's the way you make a positive statement or an affirmative sentence, okay? You want to be smaller. Okay, so let's go with that. I will go one by one with you so you can give me an example of present perfect. Okay, let's go with Maria Gomez. Oh, wait. You have the subject, you have the subject already. It says I. I, I, I have, I have visited, visited. Excellent, visited, visited. I visited my family. Family. Excellent. I have visited my family. Chicos, antes de continuar, está lenta mi conexión. Me ven así como uh, uh, lento. No? Okay. No. Okay, perfect. Eh, Rafael. Yes. En mi computadora, no sé los demás, eh, veo borrosa la pantalla. Yes, me too. Yeah. Yeah. Face. De la presentación. It's not clear about that. Is the presentation there. okay let me see if i can make it bigger yes okay better better, better. better. yes better no this is not getting clear hold on here okay there no. we go a little bit more a little bit more yes better. more or less better okay so i subject have visited my family. Let's go with the second example. Let me see, Alvin, you have visited my family. You have visited my family. Tu has visitado mi familia, okay. Oh, 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 wait, 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 there is a rule. No, don't repeat the verb. Two uh, times. Okay. <laughs> uh, you have um, 
you have seen uh, you have uh, you have seen a song with me oh sing okay what's the past part of sing no no sing cantar uh, sing sing, sing. sing. Sang song. Sang song. Sing song song. Yeah, sing song song. You have sung a song. Hold on. Have sung a melody with me. Okay, you have sung a melody with me. And yes, you can say you have sung a song. You have song with me. Excellent. Very good. Let's see. Jonathan. He. He has uh, played the guitar. The guitar. Okay. He has played the guitar. He has played the guitar. Thank you. Bertha, she. He, she has traveled. Traveled. To uh -huh. To Go. Panama. To Panama. Traveled. She has traveled to Panama. Very good. Great job. Gabriela, let's go with it. It uh, worked all day. It worked. It how it have worked oh. all day. Okay, it has worked all day. Perfect, okay. It has worked all day. And we have we, Ernesto Molina. Uh, we, we, we have studied uh, English today. Sorry, give me one second. Okay. We have studied English all day. Okay. Okay, English all day. Perfect. Okay, we have Aleida Raquel. Yes, with we. With you. With you. You. You, you have uh, uh, began to make exercise yesterday. Uh, you have begun to do exercise. Do exercise, okay. Exercise sounds better, right? You have begun to exercise, okay? Hmm. Yesterday. Yes. It's been so slow for some reason since yesterday. You have began to exercise yesterday. And last one, day. Uh, Melissa, no, Gabriel, no, hold on. Melissa Aguilar, please turn on your computer, guys. Uh, he, I mean, your, he brought, no, he has brought uh, shoes. Okay, they, no, the, shoes. The, the, um, the subject is they, they. Uh, because they, they have a brow um, shoes. Brought. Bro. Traer, okay. They have brought shoes. Is that what you're trying to say, Melissa? Uh, no. Um, they uh, they have broke compra. Oh, bought. 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 Okay. Sorry, I want to. Um, I don't remember. How do you spell bought? B O U G H T. Very good. <laughs> they have shoes. They have bought shoes. Very good. Okay. So that's the way you do it. Great job, guys. Great. Teacher. Yes. My um, the screen is. Um, no se logra ver lo que está escribiendo. Okay. Let me show you. This is what we just did, okay? This is what we have done. This is what we have done. The positive statements, you have 
The subject auxiliary of the present perfect have or has, and then the past participle of her, the third form. So if you say leer, leí, leído, correr, corrí, corrido, oh, 20 minutes, and so on. Escribir, escribí, escrito. No es escribido, cuidado. Escrito, okay? <laughs> okay. So, following the example, and then you have some sort of compliment, of course. So, I have visited my family. You have son. Oh, you have sung. S O N G. I'm sorry. I missed. You have sung a melody with me. He has. Don't forget this. Mind this. The third person. Okay. Mind this. First and second person, you say have. The third person, you say has. Okay. Okay. Sorry. Good. Great job. And I have a challenge, really quick, a challenge. Make a sentence with a figure. Can somebody make a sentence with a figure? Teacher, sorry, I can't see very well the, the screen. You cannot see the screen? No. You see the little guy with the glass on it? The no? screen is free, sir. No. Okay, no. so. No, Rafael, we can we can see the the sentences. You can oh no 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 but oh, the screen is blank. Ahorita está blanco la pantalla. Debería de haber solo una letra blanca en un fondo celeste. No. 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 Hay pantalla azul, eh, letras negras, pero no se logra ver qué es lo que ha escrito. Uh -huh. Solo las primeras dos. Okay, so sad. Qué triste la verdad. A ver, dice, make a sentence with a figure. Hacer una oración con una figura. Okay, let me escape this. Okay. What is a figure? What is a figure? Beautiful. People? It's a figure. With a figure. Figure, figure. 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 Uh -huh. Let me give you an example. Um, the economy. Of El Salvador. The economy of El Salvador. Mm. Mm -hmm. Has gone crazy. The economy of the world. Okay, the world economy has gone crazy. What's the figure? The economy of the, of the world or the world's economy. That's a figure. A figurative a figurative subject, okay? Okay. Just think about it. At this point, you have to replace the subject with something really quick. So, let's go with the negative form. Can you, you see the screen? I know, yeah. Okay. yeah. Yes. Yes. Subject, now. Auxiliary plus not. That's the only difference. So, example, you mean example, Aida, Raquel? Aida. Ah, yeah, sorry. Yeah, um, I have not, um, I have not broken this, this glass. Okay, this glass. I haven't contracted. I haven't broken this glass. I haven't broken this glass. Like that? Okay, Francisco Martinez, can you give an example of a negative sentence with the subject you? You. You have not traveled this year. Perfect. You haven't traveled this year. Okay, you haven't traveled this year. Let's go with Eunice de la Paz. No? Yes. Okay, give me an example with he. He haven't, he has, he has not. He hasn't. Uh, 
he has not uh, worked at play. He hasn't worked at? At late. At late um, or late. So we don't need the purple. He hasn't worked late. He hasn't worked late. He hasn't, he hasn't worked, worked late. late. Very good. Excellent. Okay. okay. Uh, Carla Molina. She. She. Has not visit the grandmother. Hmm. Okay. Can you correct the sentence? Can you try to correct the sentence, guys? What's wrong? The what? verb. The verb. Number one, the verb should be in third form, right? Visited. She has visited her grandmother. Her perfect a pronoun. Thank you. Her. her grandmother. Okay. Excellent. Next, Saida. It. Uh, my dog wasn't eating cookies. Wasn't eating. Eight. Okay. Hasn't. Ah, hasn't. Hasn't. Eating cookies. Cookies. Okay. Uh -huh. Good. Okay. My dog or it, it hasn't eaten cookies. My dog hasn't eaten cookies. Excellent. Very good. Josue Aguilar, give me an example with. Okay. We have not. Uh... Wait, wait, wait. Have not? Uh, we haven't had not um, mm. here very well here. Okay, we haven't. We haven't heard. We haven't heard. Uh, we haven't. Yeah. We have not. We haven't very heard very well. Very well. Very, very well. Very well. Okay. Let's go with the next. So this is negative. Okay. This was negative. Keep that in mind. Okay, and always don't forget, don't forget, you always need to mind this. First and second persons, you need have, and third person, you need has. Has. Okay, let's go with the next part. The question. Don't forget, on the question, you just need to move the auxiliary to the beginning, and then you have have or has the subject. And the past participle of the verb and the complement. So, really quick, let me see. Jacqueline, let's go with, you know what? Let's go with they. Let's make a question. They. Mm -hmm. Question. Um, have they. Excellent. They. Have they dance Bashara? <laughs> <laughs> Hey, and don't forget the question mark. Don't forget the question mark. Great job. Thank you, Jacqueline. Have they danced? <laughs> they danced, Bechara. I like that. Okay. And what's the answer, by the way? What is the answer? Yes, they have. Or no. Have. They haven't. They haven't. They haven't. Let's go with you. Have you played poker? Somebody? Okay, thank you. Marilena, oh my God, your voice is so deep. Marilena, have you played poker? <laughs> okay, thank you. Yes, I have. No, I haven't. Or yes, we. Okay. Yes, we have. No, we haven't. You is ustedes, right? Have you, have you played poker? Thank you. Let's go with the third person, Maria Gomez. We. Um, oui. She. Ah, uh, she. Uh, she. 
has she walk has she walk in the bar in the in the park in the park okay has she worked in the park yeah the amusement park okay has she worked in the park worked 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 okay any questions with the person perfect questions no i have oh, no. is it raining is it raining yes is it raining yes. okay right before we move on let's um let's let me check it and it's really quick with you if i say your name you have to say present okay or here okay so i'm gonna start with there we are. Okay, so I'm going to start with Carla Eugenia Molina Barraza. Please turn on present. your... Present. Okay. So you said present. Okay, Carla Eugenia Molina Barraza. Let's go with Marvin Josue Aguilar Martinez. Marvin Josue Present. Okay, thank you. Present. Thank you. Ricardo Alexander Rodriguez Guzman. Ricardo Guzman? No, right? There's no Ricardo Guzman. Okay. Let's go with Berta Patricia Alemán de Argueta. Here, teacher. Here, teacher. Thank you. Thank you, Berta. Let's go with Ismenia Abigail Trejo Hernández. Here. Here, thank you. So, Xiomar Hernández de Linky. De Linky. I'm here. Yeah, I can see. Well, I cannot see your face, Xiomar. Yes, I'm here. Alvin Jose Silva Romero. Right here, sir. Thank you. Maria Elena Tamayo Ventura. Here, teacher. Thank you, Maria Elena. Okay, I have Eunice de la Paz Jimenez. Here, teacher. Excellent. Jonathan Alexander Castillo Ramos. Here, teacher. I see you here. Jacqueline Giovanna Guardado Calderón. Here. Thank you, Jacqueline. Jose Ernesto Molina Guzman. Here, teacher. Yep, thank you. Melissa Ivez Aguilar Flores. Present. Thank you. Okay, Gabriel Alexander Alvarado. Third teacher. Thank you, Gabriel. Saida Carolina Hernandez. Present. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Flores. Saida. <laughs> Saida, sorry. Walter Abraham Hernandez Sanchez. Hmm. Walter Abraham. Mm -mm. He's not here. Okay. Francisco Adrián Martínez Villalobos. Here, teacher. Excellent. Thank you. María Soledad Gómez. Here, teacher. Thank you. We have Vanessa Alexandra Ortiz Cedillos. Vanessa Alexandra, no, right? Uh oh, okay. Good. Aleida Raquel Vázquez Unsin. I'm here, teacher. Excellent. Thank you very much. Okay, guys, don't worry. We will repeat this process at 9.45. Ricardo Alexander is coming. Ricardo Alexander. Alexander. Where is Ricardo Alexander? Man, the storm is getting strong. Ricardo Alexander, can you hear me? Ricardo Alexander, no. 
Okay, Ricardo Alexander on one, Ricardo Alexander, I'm sorry, on one, on two, on three, no, okay. Yeah, there it is, Ricardo Alexander, can you please turn on your camera and say hello? I guess it's an internet problems. Um, and I need your confirmation, guys, when I ask for the attendance. I have to make sure that you are with us. Ricardo Alexander? No, not Ricardo Alexander. Okay, let's move on, guys. So, on our next topic, we have to discuss and answer some questions, okay? We have to talk about the main topic of this unit, which is, okay? which is the product life cycle right to present to the presentation. Please let me know if you can see the presentation. Can you see the presentation? Yes. Yes. No, no teacher. No, no. no. no teacher. No. Only, only, only see you the one. Okay, perfect. Yeah, I'm presenting. So pay attention. The product life cycle. This is the first unit book is page number nine okay page number nine so let's start first thing have you ever participated let's see have you ever participated in the development of a new product hmm. have you ever participated in the development of a new product let me think about it hmm. let me think now that you mention it yes i have been part of a group to develop a new product. We, we tasted the possible ingredients for the new pizza before they introduced it to the market. Okay, that was the first part of your book, stage number one. Okay, then you have the second part. What is a product or service that your company has recently introduced to the market? Well, they've recently launched a new pizza called the candy pizza. And yes, it's got candies on it. Okay, in it. So candies on a pizza. Do you like candies on a pizza? No. You... No. Oh. oh. You say okay. you, right? Really? You. You. Okay. So let's work on this. Let's work around this topic. Let's talk about it, shall we? Pay attention. Let's talk about it, shall we? Shall we? Yes. Shall we? Yes. Shall we? <laughs> Shall we? Shall we? This is archaic English, okay? This is archaic English. It's okay. Archaic. Old, old English. Shall we? Okay. And let's split the class. Okay. What is that? Okay. Let's split the class. I'm going to split the class in groups. So you have to work in small groups, making these two. Questions. That's it. Just make these two questions to your classmates. Question number one, have you ever participated in the development of a new product? This is on page nine on your workbook. What is a product or service that your company has recently introduced to the market? Okay, so for the first time, I will split you into groups. We are, how many? 19, great, great number. So we're gonna be in groups of five or four, okay? On your screen, you will see an invitation. Please accept the invitation on your screen, okay? Let's see, let's see, four, five, okay, there we go. So we're gonna be four groups, ready? Please ready. Accept, the ready. accept the invitation on your, screen so we can go to the break rooms i'll be there with you i'll be there with you in the classrooms in the small classrooms there we go perfect good 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 Company. Ah, okay. 
I, I think so. <laughs> that is the question. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. okay pizza but... made of candy. I don't know. What do you think? Or, or a pizza with candy. I'm understanding it's a pizza made with candies. Okay, but the, there are two questions that you have to... Okay, first question. Have you ever participated in the introduction? Let's see. In, it said, I'm sorry. <laughs> That's it. Wait one second. Uh, it said, have you ever participated in the development of a new product? So developing a new product. Okay. Creating a new product, the ingredients or the parts or the idea, the concept idea of a new product. Have you ever participated in, in that part? No, I haven't. You haven't? No, okay. I haven't. No, no. You know, I tasted, I tasted uh, the pizza from Telepizza before they launched it at the market. Yeah. They tried, they tried to make a Salvadorian pizza with chicharron and it didn't work. <laughs> I mean, it was delicious. <laughs> but it was too greasy you know too much grease yes so, it was too much. so we tried that we tried queso con loroco we tried so many things you know in the end you have the classica and it worked i mean we had chorizo with vegetables you know and beans it was delicious so that was the part of the development the second question is so the first question is have you ever participated in the development of a new product? Question number two, what is a product or service that your company has recently introduced to the market? In your company, any service, any new product? For example, Inglés Corporativo is launching uh, virtual classes, virtual classes, you know, for work. So that's the new product. We're testing it right now. So make the question, go around your classmates. Hey, make it up. Listen, make it up. Invent it. Okay, that's the meaning of make it up. Make it up is inventatelo, okay? Make it up. Okay, make it, pretty, make it up. Ma yeah, pretty, okay. make it up. Okay, I'll go with another group. Please practice English or okay. no Spanish, okay? Okay, I will try. Thank you. Try. <laughs> okay, thank you. Let me search. How do you say toy feminina in English? How do you say what? Toy feminina. Oh my god. I don't know. <laughs> in English. I don't know because the I know I uh, contact is a name of uh, a brand. 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 But uh, all people's uh, name, Cotex. Uh, bad, bad. I heard in movies when they say, can you get me some towel? Some towels? Pad? Really? A pad? No. A pad. Something That's strange. Uh, yeah. All this. Some A towel. Yeah, sanitary. Towel. Sanitary towel. Pen towel. Pen towel. <laughs> Maybe. It could be pen towel, yeah. Okay, so what, what have you ever participated in the development of a new product? That's the first question. Yeah. Okay, can you give me an example of a response, an answer? In my, in my case, um, uh, when, I was my, uh, when I was younger, I was to a um, uh, focal group for, uh, to know the new presentation for Pilsener. Oh, so, right. yeah, so we taste the 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 product we see the different way that they want to to perform the new pilsener and that kind of things to better and, and they paid me for that yeah to to better the the pilsener you say to better the pilsener uh, uh, to no to improve yeah improve the to, presentation of pilsener to better or to improve the presentation of pilsener perfect yeah. Was it delicious? Was it good? Uh, 
I, I, I prefer to drink when I when I have a, a deshidratated. I don't, know, I don't know how do you say deshidratado. <laughs> Dehydrated. Dehydrated. Ah, okay. Hydrated. Alvin, good sp good English. Just thank you. Just go slower. Try to articulate every word that you are saying and the final sounds, okay? Try. Yeah. You said something right now. Uh, drink, it, it, drink. Listen. Drink. 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 Yeah. Good job. It's because when I, when I speak lower, I, I don't know, maybe I, I, I think in Spanish and that is my, I prefer to speak. Has uh, to speak, you to speak yeah. faster in Spanish. I understand. La manera en la que hablas inglés, la manera en la que hablas español, vas a hablar inglés. Same thing. Good. Okay. Thank okay. you. Uh, Maria, what is a product or service that your company has recently introduced to the market? The microphone. The microphone. <laughs> okay. Um, I, I have a participate in a test for a new machine, mm -hmm. but print, passport print, mm. um, but, but, um, how do you say, um, still, but still don't, 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 don't finish. But still, no, no. We, still but still, we haven't. We haven't finished. 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 Yeah, okay. Okay, very good. You can also say we haven't finished yet. Finished yet. <laughs> we haven't finished yet or still we haven't finished. Yeah. Yet, still. Still, we have finished. still yet. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's move on. Let's continue, guys. Continue speaking. I'll be back with you, okay? I'm going to another group. Okay. Same questions. Someone else. <laughs> Hello, Rafael. Hello, teacher. Okay, are you making... <laughs> there are two questions that you have to make to your classmates, right? Yes. Yes. Okay. I'm all ears. I'm all ears. I'm all ears. Okay. Only, only a people uh, are participating in in a develop of a new product. So she, she said it. <laughs> she will tell you. She will. Yes. She will. Will tell you. Tell you. Okay. Good. When you say. Okay. Go ahead. What's it? <laughs> Abigail. <laughs> okay, Abigail. <laughs> okay. Okay. Um, I'm for at the move your university. Can you hi? Hello. Hi. Yeah, you're you're breaking up. I'm sorry. It's low. There you go. Hi. Okay. It's better. Can you? Te juro que pensé que era una foto. Y, oh my God. <laughs> no. Uh, at the university, I participate in a festival about the marketing. So my group and I create a, um, a drink with alcohol and, and just that. This is the new product that uh, I create. I, okay. <laughs> creative, creative, creative. Very good. Okay. Uh, so, like Michelada, I guess. Okay. She's pretty. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. Uh, no. Uh, like frozen mm -hmm. with alcohol and fruit. 
Like sandia, Hi. for example, watermelon. Okay, perfect. Like pineapple. Pineapple. And pineapple, sorry. And Water. mangoes. Mangoes. Frozen, mango frozen. Wow. Yes. <laughs> yes. So, yes. Yes. And with so, I'll wash them. With I'll wash them. Okay. Ernesto, have you ever. And I'll wash them. Yeah. Have you ever participated in the introduction or is your company, no, what was the second question? What was the last product that your company introduced to the market? Mm -hmm. where, where do you work? Sorry, teacher. Yeah, can you repeat? Yeah, where where do you work, Jonathan? Uh, where do you work? I work at Haynes. Haynes, okay. What was the last product that Haynes introdu introduced to the market? And let me see. I I think that the new product is a socks. Is a new sock socks? socks? New socks. New socks. Mm -hmm. uh, That's a plural name. You cannot say ah, socks. It's socks. Socks. Jeans. Okay. Scissors. Glasses. Okay, good. Socks. I, I, I remember that. Socks. Okay. Uh, it's, a, it's a product that you can use uh, only time mm -hmm. and, and didn't have a problem with your with your but body, uh, for example, if you, uh, sorry, but I can, I can, how do you say sudar? Sweat. Sorry? Sweat. 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 Okay. Mm -hmm. You can sweat much. <laughs> okay. It's a, it's a, That's good. Okay. Great. Okay, guys, I'm going with the last group and then we come back together, okay? All okay. together. Okay. One second, I'm just missing one more group. Any product? Because um, only buy and selling. Hmm. Um, Service. Services. Services. Oh. Services. Services. Yes. Uh, uh, actually, uh, right now, we are buying uh, um, service. Um, installation of oh, installation 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 uh, what what is the company what's the company it's a ferretería oh a hardware store mm -hmm. so you're breaking up did you say hardware store una ferretería Okay. okay okay a hardware store so what is the latest product they have introduced to the market it's a service it's a service okay, okay. good making um, we we make casetas de 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 sanitización. Oh, really? Okay. That's really good. Okay. Anyway. Teacher. Yes. Teacher, how do you say ferretería? Har oh. Hardware store. Oh. Could you spell that, please? Yes. Or. <laughs> mm 
I can actually write it down for you. One second. Well, teacher, I, and I, I associate like a computer, something like when you say hardware store. <laughs> yeah, it's, it sounds the same, exactly. Yeah. A hardware store. A-H-A-R-D-W-A-R-E-S-T-O-R-E. Hardware store. It's like a, it's like a the same with the with the stuff of computer, right? Hardware and software. Yeah, the physical like the same of the computer, hardware, exactly. Okay. Hardware store. Okay. Very good. Okay, guys, let's let's go together. Let's go okay. to to the main room. Okay. Bye. Bye, guys. Berta, uh, bye, whatever. Don't leave. <laughs> okay, let's go back. Okay, so we are all back. 18. We are 18 now. It's 9.27, and it's time for me to uh, give you a little a little uh, class about the topic on your book, okay? So, let's talk about the product life cycle. Let me just quickly check here. Okay. So let's talk about the product life cycle, guys. What is the product life cycle? It's the same thing as your life, okay? There are parts. Okay? Does this does this ring any bell? Can you, okay. Turn off your microphone, please. Please turn off your microphones. Okay, thank you. So, listen and read. Um, okay, Ernesto, can you see the screen? Yes, teacher, yes, teacher, yes. Gabriel, can you see the screen? Can you please turn on your camera? Okay. okay. So this, thank you. Thank you. Okay, does this ring any bell? Does this ring any bell? This is a common question in America, okay? In the United States, they tend to say, does this ring any bell? Does this ring any bell? Does this ring any bell? The meaning, the meaning is, uh, algún recuerdo? ¿Te trae algún recuerdo de esto? Okay. Okay. Does this ring? ¿Te suena? Te suena. Perfect. Thank you. Okay. Does this ring any bell? Market introduction. Market introduction. Hmm. Growth. But let me see, Carla. What is market introduction? What do you think? Uh, it's, um, you study. Uh, the people you want to sell something and you have to present your product and see how it is received. How it is received. Very good, Carla. That's a good idea. Let's go with the second one. Growth. Listen, growth. 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 Okay. Growth. Ernesto, what do you think? Does this ring any bell to you? Growth? Growth, like maturity, no. like like develop, like uh, getting better or something like that. Improving, okay. Growth, good. Improving, improving, okay. Decline, decline. What is decline? Someone else, come on, guys, participate. Is when it's not accepted. You are not accepted. Like when you say to your boyfriend, right, Leda? No, no, stop it. Get away, right? Decline. Okay, that's uh, reject. 
reject, that's a synonym. Reject, decline. That's good. Decline. So, decline in a, an invitation. Decline an invitation. Or, or a product. Or, or. Maturity, Gabriel, maturity. Maturity. It's mature. like, maturity is like the top uh, or the fish, uh, the, uh, the end or but the cycle. Okay. Like cycle. Like cycle, dry? No? Okay. Life but cycle. Life cycle. Life yes. cycle. Life cycle. So then you go old. Okay, so what is PLC? The product life cycle. What is PLC? Okay. PLC, the meaning. Okay, ah. let's go with the, the meaning. Okay, there's a lot of words here. It says, all products, let me mute you please, one second. Okay. All products have certain length of life during which they pass through certain identifiable stages. The product life cycle is a conceptual representation of product aging process. Aging process. Like your life, like your life is divided into stages same as life of a product is also divided. So life of the product is also divided on stages from its birth, from its birth till growth, okay? And then die, that's it. The same thing as humans. Product start with introduction to the market for the purpose of sale. The demand of the product is gradually increased in the market and it reaches to its maximum from where it starts declining it is effective lifespan of a product okay now you're an intermediate three but i'll give you the chance okay please tell me any new words do you see any new words here yeah. Yes. Okay. Yes. Let's start with Alvin. Alvin is very thoughtful right now. Uh, um, when the PLC is a conceptual rep representation of a product aging, this is new for me. Aging. Yeah. Quiero que busques la raíz de esa palabra. Aging. Ag edad. Perfect. So. Edad. Aging. Yeah. Yeah, but this is the first time for me. <laughs> I, I never hear about that. So. Perfect. I know age and edad, so. Yeah, so aging, when you go aging, okay? It's the process of aging, getting older, good. Yeah. Always, always look for the root of the words. So you have age, aging, good. Uh-huh, Xiomara? Length, all products have certain length. Length, length. Length. I can find it, L-E-N-G-H-T, length. Yeah. Length. Okay, uh, okay, that means um, this is the length. This is the length of time. Brecha. Ah, length of life during which they pass through, okay. Yeah, the length of time in which it happened. Um, the, the brecha, yeah, I think this brecha. That's the meaning. Distancia. distancia, right? Yeah, the length. What's the length? What's the distance? Yes, the distance. Excellent, very good. Another one, another one. Okay. Okay. Jonathan. Uh, rich. Hey, one of you. One of you lives in Mexicanos. I know. I just. Yeah, heard, I live in Mexicanos. Heard the thunderstorm. <laughs> oh, it's raining here in Santa Tecla too. Yes, yeah, there's an electrical storm. It's an electrical storm. Okay, I'm sorry. I didn't get the last thing you said. Who said something? Okay, what's the next word? No? Light, life span. 
live strong work star um it's effective live spam of a product it is effective live spam of a product is the fact of a product giving you margin you know giving you money so effective live spam of a product so effective giving you money enough money during that time Okay, that's the lifespan. It is effective lifespan of a product. So that's the life cycle. You have to plan every single stage. So let's look at the stages. Think about the product life cycle like this. The life stages of Roberts, the life stages of Abigail's. Okay, so you go with Bobby, Robbie, Rob, Robert, Bob, and Rip. Okay, so first you're a baby, then you become a teenager, then um, a, an, um, an older teenager, let's say. Then you go adult, adult, then you go, um, what is it? Elderly, you become elderly, and finally, you die. So it's the same thing with the product life cycle, okay? What is the market introduction? Let's move on. What time is it? Okay, we're missing 20 minutes. Market introduction, okay guys? I'll go step by step. It is the first stage in where the product is launched in the market with full scale of production and marketing programming. So it means it's the first time, this is, listen, the life, uh, the product life cycle is when you already have the concept you created the product and then you throw it to the market. Okay? Like your first job, como su primer trabajo, anadar pato. The same thing. You throw the product to the market for the first time. Or the replacement of a pre existing product. So, have you noticed how head and shoulder, for example, head and shoulder is always innovating with different, different sorts of shampoo? Have you noticed that now they have the carbon carbon fiber shampoo? Okay, and so on. What are the characteristics of this stage? This stage number one, the market introduction. First, you have low and slow sales. No sales, maybe. High production price. So the cost to produce a new product is really high. Heavy promotional expenses, okay? You have to spend a lot of money to promote a new product. Lack of knowledge, lack of knowledge. You don't know what you're doing. You don't know what you're doing. Low profits, so you don't get too much income. And narrow, narrow product lines, so very short, straightened uh, product lines, okay? Is this clear like water from the Aselguate? Yeah. Yes. Yes. Okay. yes. Yes. Let me give you the joke here. And this remote will help me convince you to buy our new product. You get it? No? Okay. Let's move on. <laughs> okay. And lastly, on your book, on your book, you find this definition please pay attention this is the definition that you need on your book and make sure you learn this you learn this is on your homework so after the class you stay for a few minutes go to the forum and there are some questions that you need to answer on the forum got it okay got it okay so Market introduction. At this stage, a new product is brought into the market. The demand of the product might be low. And marketing efforts, marketing efforts, try to develop branding, quality, and awareness of the new product to innovators. So they're trying to sell that product, okay? The second part. The second st stage number two is market growth. Okay, here, market growth, 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 
Ok, growth. 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 Rápido, cada vez que veas una... Market growth. Growth. Market growth. Cada vez que veas una TH, Z, es una Z. Es una Z. Una growth. Th growth. Es una Z. Puede estar al principio y tu lengua siempre va a venir en medio de los dientes y va a decir D. D. Ok. A veces vas a soplar, a veces... Soplas. Growth. Ok. Growth. Growth. So, once the market has accepted the product, sales begin to rise and product enter its second stage. Chips considerable. Listen. Considerable and wide... Considerable. And widespread approval in the market. The sales and profits increases at an accelerated rate. At an accelerated rate. At an accelerate. Accelerated. Accelerated. Accelerated rate. Very good, Francisco. Okay. In this effective distribution, advertising and sales promotion are considered as the key factors. So the key factor is promotion. A lot of promotions if you want to sell the product. Because people, people has, has already accepted the new product. For example, me, I'm using head and shoulders with carbon fiber. And it's good. It's good. Now, products, new products actually have rapid increase in sales. Okay. No, oh, I'm yelling. New products have rapid increase in sales. Product improvements, so it's new products, right? Increase in competition. Also, competitors, they see a new product and they go like, hey, look, there's a new product. We should create another product, you know, competition. Increasing profits, so you become richer. You become richer. Reduction in the price, so you can make productions. You can play with the price now. Strengthening, strengthening of the distribution channel. So you can um, reinforce strengthening reinforce the distribution channel. What is the distribution channel? What are you using? Are you using um, just your car, you know, to distribute it or planes? And again, this is your uh, definition on your book. The new product registers, okay? The new product registers an increase in demand because more customers accept it, the sales start to grow, and there is little competition. So at this point, you make money. In this level, in market growth, look, you make more money. Okay? Okay, let's move on. Stage number three. Where is it? Okay. Market maturity. And this is very important. On market maturity, what happens is that everybody has accepted your product. They know about it. They know about your product, you know, everybody has it and that's it. Okay, uh, hello guys? Yeah. Okay, we're good, right? So market maturity, everybody has accepted your product, okay? And there is something very important. A key factor here is the market uh, stock. So it's like selling refrigerators. Everybody has a refrigerator. The demand, this is key, the demand is satisfied. The demand is satisfied. Who doesn't have a refrigerator nowadays? Everybody has a refrigerator. Can you, can you sell new refrigerators to the market? Ooh, maybe, right? Maybe. Okay, one a month, two a month, maybe. Right. Refrigerators, okay. The characteristics, sales increases at decreasing rate. So you go like this, you bounce on the sales. Normal promotional expenses, uniform and lower prices. Sometimes you lower the price. You make some modifications to the product and you have some dealers support. Other people buys a lot of your product to sell it and the profit margin decreases, so you don't make too much money, okay? And your definition, your definition of this part, sorry, is this, on your book, page nine, the growth in sales decreases because there are many competitors. Market saturation occurs. The marketing efforts work to differentiate 
the product and prices might be lower than in the previous stages. And the last part, last part of this topic is the decline in sales, the market decline. The market is full of your product, everybody is bored, they don't want that product anymore. anymore. So you start thinking, you start thinking about taking the product out of the market. Don't produce it anymore. It's enough. Okay? The characteristics, rapid decrease in sales, further, listen, further decrease in prices. No promotional expenses. You don't want to promote the product anymore. No. Suspension of the production work. And your definition on your book on page nine should be this one. Sorry, I'm waiting. The product is no longer attractive for many customers. Sales stop. Okay, and the producers start making decisions about discontinuing the product, buying out competitors, or selling it to another producer. So that's hmm. it. As simple as that. It doesn't exist anymore. Okay. Now, what time is it? I think we're missing just 12 minutes. I'm going to do something again. We're going to check uh, the attendance one more time because it's part of the steps that we must follow. But before that, do you have any questions about the life of the product, the product life cycle? I'm sorry, PLC, product life cycle. I have a comment. Yes, sir. Um, this, this situation is not for Coca-Cola company <laughs> because they have a, a war of, of sodas in 80s and they make uh, some uh, changes in, in, in his product product but uh, in the end they comes to the the basic so they have we have the the same coca-cola so <laughs> they they doesn't need to improve uh, they, their product they don't need to improve the product what do you fact, think they, they sent a new coca-cola and that was a big fail in fail. the 80s big fail You are a mood. Okay. I know, I know. I was just checking my internet speed for some reason is decreasing. Uh, I don't know why. But can you hear me well? Yeah. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. <clears throat> I want to hear you, yeah. Yes. And what do you think about that? What Alvin just mentioned about Coca Cola, a new I product. I think that Coca Cola is like a drug. <laughs> because generate uh, addiction for the people there are, that you know? there are rumors that it has it has um, cocaine yeah yeah <laughs> because uh, the coca-cola only changed the marketing and the um <laughs> i don't remember the the word the um, the marketing strategy Yes, yes, and I think. But the so. product is always the same. They try, yes. They tried it, as Alvin said. They tried it to add vanilla flavor, vanilla flavor, uh, the light, <laughs> light Coca Cola. <laughs> no sugar, sugar free. Yes, and Coca Cola light and Coca -Cola. another idea, ideas. No Coca Cola light. Yeah, that's a clear example of the opposite to this topic. That's the clear example of the opposite to this topic. So you have a life, uh, the life, whole life of a new product. So think about it so we can continue with that tomorrow. I'm gonna check the list again. I'm sorry guys, give me one second. Have to make sure that you are all here. Okay, so let's do it again. I have Carla Eugenia Molina Barraza say here. Here. Thank you. Marvin Josu Aguilar Martinez. Here. Yes, here. Yeah. Alexander Rodriguez Guzman. Ricardo Alexander is not here. Oh, yeah, here he is. Okay, I see you, Ricardo. Can you speak? Hello. Thank you, Ricardo. That's enough. <laughs> Bertha Patricia Limán. Thank you, Bertha. Ismenia Abigail Trejo. Ismenia, Ismenia, where are you? Oh, I see you. Okay. Here. Xiomara Hernandez Delinky. 
I'm here. Thank you. We cannot see you. Hopefully tomorrow you have a camera. Alvin yes. Jose. Yeah, got it. Maria Elena Tamayo Ventura. I see you. Thank you. Here, teacher. <laughs> Sorry. Eunice de la Paz Jimenez. Here, teacher. Okay, there you go. Here. Thank you. Jonathan Alexander Castillo Ramos. Here, teacher. Thank you. Jacqueline Giovanna Guardado. Here. Thank you. Jose Ernesto Molina Guzmán. Here, teacher. Oh, thank you, Ernesto. Here. Melissa Ivette Aguilar. Here, teacher. Thank you. Gabriel Alexander Alvarado. Here, teacher. Got it. Okay, Saida Carolina Hernandez Flores. Here. See you. Thank you. Walter Abraham Hernandez Sanchez. Walter, he wasn't here before. Where is Walter? No Walter, right? Okay, yeah, Walter is not here. Francisco, Ad Francisco Adrián Martinez. Oh, there he is. Okay, thank you, Francisco. Maria Soledad Gomez. Yeah. Okay, Vanessa Alexandra Ortiz. No, Vanessa Alexandra, Vanessa Alexandra. Okay. No, she wasn't here. And Aleida Raquel. I'm here. Thank you. I think I said this time. Good, guys. Let's move on. So, uh, Xiomara, please try to repair your camera for tomorrow. We are dying to see your face. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay, guys. Let's wrap it up. Let's wrap up our class uh, tonight. I want your, I want your feedback in English. Okay. Check the video. Check this video online. Go to the forum on your platform at inglescorporativo.net. Go to the forum. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah, when you stretch, you know how it is, right? It's 10 o'clock. So I want to hear you. What do you think? What did you like about the topic? Please go to the forum for a few minutes. You will find a question that I made on the forum on their video conferencia numero uno, the product life cycle, okay? La, el ciclo de vida del producto, I think it says. I think it's in English, I can't remember. So go check the forum, leave your comments. You have to leave one comment at least so I can reply to you with any comments. And remember, there is a homework that you need to be doing at least at night, if I were you, if I were you, I would be doing my homework right after the class. So tomorrow, you know, chill, relax. Okay. Do you have any questions? No, I do have a question. I have an observation. We still have five minutes. Give me one second. Where is it? Where is it? Where's the classroom screen? Okay, here it is. Okay, the main of this group is the ED endings. ED endings. How do you pronounce the past and the participle of regular verbs? So if, for example, I say work, okay? If I say work, you just add ED, right? Number one. Well, Work. Yeah, you say worked. 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 Give me one second. Mute, mute. Okay, you say work. That's the present. The past is worked. Worked. Okay. If I say play, okay, I say played. played. Second word. Played. Played. Okay. played. played easier or more clear 
save. Oh God, sorry. Give me one second. If I say save, save, there is vibration. Save. There is vibration in my mouth if I say bit save. save. So I add save. The, it says save. 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 Okay. And the last rule. If the verb ends on T or in D sounds already, then I just said ed. Okay. If I say act, and I add ed, then it says act. Act. Active. 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 Reacted. 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 Okay. Good. And so on. So look for this. Look for it. Research. That's your homework. You have to work. I mean, that, that will be your second homework, let's say. Go to the platform. Do the first homework about the topic, about the product life cycle, and then investigate, do a research on EV endings, regular verbs, okay? And one more thing. Forget about only. Forget about only and start saying just. Just a minute. Just a minute. Okay? For example. A uh, minute. Yes, I'll do it. I'll do it. Alvin. Yep. Okay. So that's it for me now. Um, do you have any questions? Suggestions? We still have two minutes. No questions. I'm satisfied with this class. Are you sure? Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Teacher. Wednesday, on Wednesday, you will have 10 minutes. With me, you know, you and me, we're gonna. You can ask one, you know, if you have any doubts in grammar. Yes, Gabriel, you said something. Uh, in the platform, we have only two chains to complete the homework. Yes? Two things. Two chains. Yeah. Two chains. You have to go to the platform and. Two opportunity. Oh, two chances. Two chances. Yes, two chances. Oh, really? No. Yeah. Couldn't believe it. Uh, I, 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 bueno, traté de, I tried it. De completarla. I tried to, com to complete. <laughs> and when I. Cuando hice la corrección, de verdad, no. Uh, no me dejó ya. It didn't let you to do any corrections. Uh, that's really weird. I'll check on that. I'll check on that. Okay, so give me just one more minute of your time, okay? It's okay. Uh, Rafael. Yes. Maybe when we have a, a time with you, uh, you can uh, make us to read for you and you make a, a, um, Correction. review. Corrections. Correction. Exactly. Actually, yeah, for some reason we didn't finish today. For some reason, we didn't finish today, but I think it was good. I mean, the main idea was the product life cycle. Tomorrow, we will do some role plays, okay? And make sure we continue the reading tomorrow, okay? During the, hey, please log in at nine. Please log in at eight, at eight, 7.59 p.m., make sure. So, on your platform, you will find this right now. You have the product life cycle vocabulary. Wow. Okay, under that, here, you will see the video. This video will be on YouTube, and you will see it here. So here, you have the discussion, the discussion forum. Okay, where is it? Here it is. Okay. Go all the way to the bottom, and you will see my question. What's your favorite? Which one represents? Is it here. Okay, so this is what you will see. You have to click on add a post, add a post, okay? And you can continue the conversation, okay? So go to the platform, go to the video, or just go all the way down on here on the topic, okay? And, and leave your words there. If you want, we continue on the chat. If you, I will be here for one more hour, okay? I'll see you tomorrow. Thank you. Good night. Good night. Thank you. See you. Thank you, teacher. Bye. 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 Good night. Good night, teacher.